hey we're back in Pixlr editor we've already selected this uh, photo of the bird's nest this is the Olympic Stadium from the Beijing Olympics and we're gonna use one of my favorite tools um, called splash and what splash does is it turns the picture black and white then asks you to select a color and so you can select one color like this which is just a blue sky and it leaves everything else black and white and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the brush to um, zoom in and basically um, bring out the colors of the chairs and so I, I want these red red and white chairs some of the banners and the blue sky alone and I'm just using my finger here um, I can adjust the brush size if I want to but just using my finger here to essentially paint and this is really easy I feel like compared to doing it on your computer with a mouse and again it's just taking anything that was black and light and restoring the original color from the photo so we're gonna go ahead and finish out the chairs here I'm gonna speed this video up a little bit so you can see uh, the final effect So this picture is looking really nice. Just do a little touch up here. I like the blue and the red, but I don't think that the colors pop out enough. So let's go ahead and apply our splash settings that we have right now. Let's go to the vibrant setting. And we'll use vibrance to maybe bring out a little bit more out of the colors. We'll apply that. And then let's jump to the color editor and let's add some saturation just to uh, give that color a little bit of pop compared to the black and white. And then finally, let's add some text. I can drag this around wherever I want. I could put it um, in the middle. Or if I kind of want to follow the rule of thirds, I could um, offset it over to the left a little bit. Apply that. And there you go. You have a really nice photo with a little bit of text that you can save. And it didn't take you very long at all.